Here we have our permobile, F5 wheelchair, and an Omni 2 display, and we're going to program it for Ability Drive. Programming it for Ability Drive is very similar to setting up a head array. So when we first start out, you might see the 08, 08 error, and that just means that things aren't configured correctly yet. So go ahead into your programming menu. And we're going to start out by going to Profile, Enable. And in Profile, Enable, we're going to enable Profile 3. Then we're going to go to Input Devices. And from Input put Devices, we're going to change Profile 1 to JS, Profile 2 to JS, and Profile 3 to Omni. Now we're going to go to Profile, and here we're going to go to Profile 3, and go all the way down to the bottom, and we're going to change it. We're going to go to Change SWIES, or Switch Input ESP, to Yes. Now we're going to go into Omni and we're going to go to Profiled in Omni and we're going to make sure this is all set to 1. Now we're going to go into Port 1 and we're going to change the SID to Switch. Then we're going to go to Switches and we're going to make sure that user switch is set to NO and that switch detect is set to off and switch long is set to zero. And you should be configured at this point. Now we're going to power it off. Go ahead and power it back on. And we can go ahead and use our tester device and connect it to the 9-pin cable from the back of the, the Omni 2. And this will allow us to make sure that the chair is configured correctly before we even install the ADT. So if you point the arrow up, that means go forward. Oh, we've got to go into Profile 3. Forward, backward side and side and that way you can check and make sure you're all configured correctly.